All right, welcome back, everybody. We are continuing season five, and we're up on episode seven today. Seven already? I know. I, I popped it up, and I saw we was on seven. I was like, dang, we almost done. Yeah. So I had to go back, had to go back and look and see what happened last season because or last episode because well, I forgot. Uh, Sansa, uh, Sansa got married. Sansa got Ramsey. married to Ramsey. Ramsey. Hey. And he, he broke much, her in. He pretty in much front did of uh, Theon. Yeah. Um. Tyr uh, Jamie and Bronn got captured. By yes. The, in Dorne. Yeah. Tyrion and Jorah got captured by slavers. Yes. First, after they had uh, the encounter with the what they call them, the great people. No, he had the stone man. So yeah. Jorah's got a little spot on his arm now yeah. of grayscale. I'm sure that's not going to work out too good for him. Oh, well. And what else? That's... Uh, what, what? Did, did Daenerys do something last episode? Because I don't want... If she did, I don't want to give it away if she didn't. <laughs> I don't know if she did or did Um... Arya is filing. Oh, in the house of she's being trained. Yeah. I'm I'm assuming because she's she is cleaning out. dead people. He she got to see the the room of faces. Yeah, the hall of faces. That wasn't a hall. That was a room. And a big, big room. They call it the hall of faces. I think. But um, she always got to shut up. <laughs> try to correct me. It was a huge room. It's a huge room. Okay. It was a room. Yeah, it was a big room. Yeah. There wasn't no hall. The hall was just a narrow walkway. I'm just saying. A hall. It also could be a concert. Okay, hall. let's get started. <laughs> <laughs> Did you kill Joffrey? That was something my new friends wanted very badly. You don't think I'd let you marry that beast? John was trying to get Tormenta just in intimate relationship. Convince his people. Oh, yeah, they. Marjorie got taken. Evidence to bring a formal oh, yeah. trial for Sir Loras and Queen Marjorie. Take her. To forge a lasting bond with the people, I will marry the leader. Oh, yeah, she did. She did do what I was thinking of. of feeding one to a dragon. Take me to Slaver's Bay. Put a sword in my hand. I'll prove my worth. My wife. Have to go, Marcella. Now. You're going to have a baby. From the way she's carrying, it looks like a boy. Yeah, he didn't like that, did he? Mm mm. Sansa's in danger, even if she doesn't realize it. Will you take this man? I take this man. I shall take back the North from the thieves who stole it. I shall mount Ruth Bolton's head on a spike. And if you go north of the wall, gather the remaining free folk wherever they are and bring them back here. I'll open the gates for them and let them through. You're coming with me. Hmm. I hope those people, the wildlings, Step John and they fight together. They could, we'll see. They might not either. Look at him. Look at him. First Ranger, you have Commander Castle Black. Lord Commander, it is my duty to tell you I believe this mission to be reckless and an insult to all the brothers who have died fighting the wildlife. As always, thank you for your honesty. Well, you never go out. you will just die out alone. Safe travels, Lord Commander. Thank you, Sam. It's dragon glass. It's what I used to kill the White Walker. I hope you don't need them. See, what they have to understand war and strategy. Yeah. This is what this is. Can't be sitting up there pouting because he decided he's going to go and... Well, they haven't seen what they the other ones have seen either. They, mm -hmm. you know, they were in the in the back of the castle when 
Aloft. They didn't see the White Walkers, so they don't know what's really know what's coming. Hey, Gluff, like that? Yeah. One of the first things I remember. His little brother, Aegon, he, he became king. <laughs> it himself, Gilliflower, before it's too late. So you're telling him to go south? Yeah. Because the White Walkers be coming soon? Yeah. Winter is coming. Locked up in the dark on castle. No one Ramsey. <laughs> so them bruises on her arm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I kill him. Theo, wait. Help me. You're his wife now. Do what he says or he'll hurt you. He really hurts me every night. It can't be any worse. It can always be worse. Mm -hmm. It's true. Help me. <laughs> Help me! Zeus, you don't know him. <laughs> Damn. My family still has friends in the north. All I need to do is give a signal and they'll rescue me. Climb to the top of the broken tower. Light this candle and put it in the window. Your name is Theon Greyjoy. Last surviving son of Balon Greyjoy, Lord of the Iron Islands. Do you hear me? Yeah. Theon gone. Mm -hmm. That's Reek. Rick said he ain't gonna get killed because of you. Yeah. Oh no, he got the candle. He gets washed. Oh Lord, I hate to see him die. Yes, Rick. Hmm. So he did what's come at the tower? So his office at the tower or something? No, he... Hey. Get some sleep, Sam. You'll have to speak for him tomorrow. You don't know that. I'll watch over him. Wait, he died? Hmm? He died? He's on his deathbed. Hey! <laughs> I think he's like a hundred and some years old. He's old. He's a good fella. life. Hey. Good life. I dreamed that I was old. Well, you didn't dream it. You lived it. <laughs> His name was Aemon Targaryen. He came to us from King's Landing. Yeah, come on. No man was wiser or kinder. He was the blood of the dragon. But now his fire has gone out. And now his watch is ended. That sniffle, what's that mean? He was crying. You thought it just cold. You're losing all your friends, Tali. Mm. How you gonna threaten him? See, I mean, really? I mean, he, him to go outside the wall. Mm. My beautiful wife, you know how pleased I was when I saw you. Mm -mm. He reek when and told. I bet it's Rick Winter. One day I'll be Lord of Winterfell and Warden of the North. You'll be my lady and Wardeness. But isn't your stepmother pregnant? What of it? What happens if she has a boy? Then I'll have a baby brother. But he'll be the heir. I'm Lord Bolton's eldest son. Mm -hmm. But you're a bastard. A trueborn will always have the stronger claim. Girl, mm. just don't piss him off. I've been naturalized by a royal decree from Tom and Baratheon. Another bastard. Hmm. Bastards can rise high in the world, like your half-brother, Jon Snow, now the Lord Commander of the Night's Watch. He didn't know. Yes, he's done very well for himself. I nearly forgot why I asked you to join. Oh, Lord. Come, my lady. Freaking toe. Mm -hmm. Your northern friend. Reek told me he wanted to leave. But why? Winterfell is your home. And I'm your husband. Her heart gave out before I even got to her face. I will kick to <clears throat> Bring my wife back to her chamber. You should hold on to your candles. The nights are so long now. Don't let him see you cry, girl. He gets, he gets off on it. I can't wait till you did. I want him, I want him dead. You hear me? I want him dead. 
Stannis them need to hurry up and get to work to feel. <coughs> and kill them. Hmm. Look, this too cold. Forty horses died in the night. Dang. We'll lose more come sunset. We're running out of food. We can't open the supply line until the snow clears. The storm crows rode off last night. The who? Storm crows. Sell swords. Loyal to nothing but gold. Oh, that was a group of people? This isn't our time. We should head back to Castle Black when the snow clears. I retreated from King's Landing, Sir Davos. If I retreat again, I become the king who ran. It's better to wait for the right time than risk everything. We march to victory. Or we march to defeat. Mm -hmm. Who He wants to say, you are an idiot. That's yeah, what he wants to say. Much. I've trusted in your visions. I don't see why. She didn't see them people leaving. Trust yourself. And you, do you trust yourself? I trust in the Lord. Mm -mm. Are you sure? I have seen myself walk along the battlements of Winterfell. I have seen... The flayed man banners lower to the ground. That's all you think about. Mm -hmm. But sometimes sacrifices must be made to ensure victory. I have shown you the power of King's blood. We don't have Robert's bastard here. We have someone better. And your blood runs through her veins. <laughs> what? Have you lost your mind? Yep. Do you doubt me? Leeches or something. There is only one way. Only you can lead the living against the dead. She'd be there. She's my daughter. Get out. I know that's real. Get out. Get your little punk. That's my I'm saying. Okay, she didn't see them people leaving. Do you all she all she see is people dying? Really? <laughs> what kind of prophecy is that? Heck, I can predict people die. Every day. A beauty from beyond the wall. <laughs> Question is, is she pretty down south in the real world or is she pretty because she's the only girl here? Not even in White Harbor. I'd want a kiss. Mm -mm. Come on, love. Give us a kiss. Leave me alone. There's no need to be rude. We just want a little affection. Mm. Get your hands off her. Sam the Slayer. You're going to slay me with that sword? We shall will. Gilly, come on. Get back to your room. Lock the door. I'm warning you. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Killed the white hog, could I? Yes, he did. Man. It's a hog. Leave it out. Oh, my God. Come on. Sam, get your butt up and fight. Shoot. Sam! Come on! Sam! Right. Sam, they better take your girl. I'm right, Pearl. You better stop. I said, get your hands off her. I killed a white walker. I killed a fen. I'll take my chances with you. Come on, kill him. Come on, kill him. Come on, kill him. Kill him. Get him, go. Sick him. Sick him. That's what I'm all right. You're not. Just a bit woozy. <laughs> Just a bit woozy. <laughs> That's right, we got that dog. That's right. He didn't take that. I didn't see that that uh ghost going along with him. Uh -huh. That wolf. The next time you see something like that, you leave it alone. I will not. You know what they would have did. Come on. I don't know what they would have done. Either. They would have killed you if ghosts hadn't come. No, no, no. They were tiring out. I had them in the palm of my hand. <laughs> what kind of man would I be if I ran away when I saw someone hurting you? I don't know that's real. Whatever happens, you'll take care of little Sam. Well, of course I will. I'll take care of you too. Mm. I need more water. Mm. I won't go nowhere, girl. Don't go nowhere. Stay. No, that's real. He can't save you laying up on the bed. You can't call ghosts laying up in bed. Oh, she kissed him on the cheek. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, please. 
Okay. Damn energy really gonna be that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he got beat up. <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah. He's like, uh, yeah. I'll suffer through for this. Yeah. Shut up, John. That's <laughs> <laughs> he done. No, I'm just. Oh, oh, oh my. <laughs> Yeah, he oh. A rare find for the fighting pits, my friend. This one's a Westerosi night. Bidding begins at 12 gold on us. Do I hear 60? 16. 20. Mm. He's like, don't leave me. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> You have to buy me as well. We're a team. I'm a great fighter, too. <laughs> it's funny. You have to give him that. <laughs> he is late, too. I'm like, that guy just sitting there. <laughs> what did I do? Oh, he did was hitting him with a whip. All right. All right. He's funny. <laughs> Hello. If I may, I've heard Marine has become a free city. You might run into trouble if you try to fight slaves. And now, if you were to fight freed men who would be paid a wage. Mm. Shut up. <laughs> He's funny, man. Should last the rest of your life. Five going one. You like, you be talking all the time. Shut up. <laughs> How long before the king of Marine comes to claim my pillow? My marriage to his daughter. It's political. I think the sons of the Harpy will stop killing because their leader was made king. Of course he is. You told me yourself I can't fight enemies within and without. So what else can I do? Marry me instead. Whatever needs. Even if I wanted to do such an inadvisable thing, I couldn't. And I know I'm here to serve my queen and not give advice. But can I make one more suggestion? Of course. On the day of the great games. Gather all the great masters and slaughter them all. Mm -hmm. I am a queen, not a butcher. Girl, you better listen to him. Mm -hmm. She'll never listen to the. Yeah. You there? Where would I find the High Septon or High Sparrow or whatever bloody fool name he's got? It's not as good a name as Queen of Thorns, I'll admit. For me, it's the knees. You? Hips. Mm -hmm. I'm here for my grandson and granddaughter. Your grandson and granddaughter swore sacred vows and lied. What is it you want? Gold? I'll make you the richest septon who ever lived. What then? I imagine this is strange for you. And everyone you meet has a hidden motive and you pride yourself on sniffing it out. Hmm. I serve the gods. Your grandchildren will be punished in the same manner as anyone. You punish Loras for shagging some perfume pomps and Marjorie for defending her brother? The gods' mm. laws must be applied to all equally. A lifetime of wealth and power has left you blind in one eye. You are the few. We are the many. <laughs> and when the many stop fearing the few... Mm, that's true. You can't do nothing to them. <laughs> How about you tell on Cersei? Who is that from? The crows. Little finger. No. Starving yourself won't make things any better for her, my love. She's in a prison cell, and there is nothing I can do. Yes, it is. She's the damn kill. king. I am the king. The queen is in prison, and there is nothing I can do. Kill your mother. No matter how strong you are, sooner or later you'll face circumstances beyond your control. That ain't fate. You going to tear. I'll call in the army. I'll take back the sect and kill every last one of them. I love her. I can't help her. Mama is sick, boy. <laughs> I will speak with the High Sparrow. There must be something... Let me he... talk to him on your behalf. Mm -mm. You'll try to help her. Mm -hmm. Can't win her freedom and her brothers. Whatever. 
your mama is the reason why they there. Be dumb to see it. Be too young and naive to see it. She wouldn't be doing that if her daddy was there. Because he'd think of the financial portion of it. You know what I'm saying? You are all that matters. You and your sister. So this satisfies your concerns about the princess's well-being. You looked different when I left. You had more hair. And more hands. <laughs> How's Tristane? You'll be all right. Your mother's worried about you. Threats have been made. The dawn's too dangerous for you. I've come to take you home. Brothers, oh <laughs> brothers, my days here are done. The Dornishman's taken my life. <laughs> He's singing. <laughs> Does it matter? If I know his voice. <laughs> yeah, he was a pop singer. Oh, is he? He was. I don't know if he is anymore, but back in the 80s hmm. or 90s yeah, in England. He's got a good voice. He does. We're lucky he's a singer. If he were a fighter, we might have been in trouble. <laughs> How's your arm? Wonderful. Wouldn't feel right to leave Dawn without a new scar. <laughs> You think you're leaving Dorn? No great hurry. Dornish women are the most beautiful women in the world. I'm not the most beautiful woman you've ever seen. In King's Landing, there was an absolutely gorgeous... <laughs> it was a what? <laughs> <laughs> there was a woman more beautiful than I am. My memory's not what it was earlier. <laughs> She's so new. How's your arm now? You seem concerned with it. You must really like me. I have mercy. And how about your head? My head? You don't even want to know what's going on. <laughs> oh, she's poor. Her nose is bleeding. It's nothing. It's the dry air. They can't kill here. I was coated with a special ointment from Ashai. They call it the long farewell. The only antidote. Who's the most beautiful woman in the world? You are. You. Don't drop it. Oh, Lord. I wouldn't trust her. I think you're very handsome as well. I don't want to trust nobody in that freaking city. Well, especially them. <laughs> You're losing money there, buddy. <laughs> Ain't nobody coming there. I'm sorry about the locale. No, you're not. It felt like the safest place. Not for your clientele, clearly. Mm -hmm. You've always been rather impressed with yourself, haven't you? <laughs> the past is the past. The future of House Tyrell. Don't pretend to have any concern for my house. I promise you. I promise you, Lord Baelish, that our fates are joined. Together we murdered a king. If my house should fall, I will have nothing to hide. Mm. Cersei summoned me to King's Landing. And what did she want? A piece of information she knew that I had. But I have other information of which she is unaware. I have a gift for you. What kind of gift? The same kind I gave Cersei. A handsome young man. Many worthy fighters have died trying to make it to the Great Games. But if you do happen to triumph here, you will fight at the Great Pit of Daznak itself, in front of the Queen. Valar Morkulis. Prepare yourselves. For generations, in the days leading up to the Great Games, it has been customary for our ruler to make the rounds of the lower pits. Your Grace. You honor us all. Stand straight for the fucking queen. <laughs> we fight and die for your glory. He's such a... Look. Look here. Really? <laughs> I don't 
think she's enjoying it too much. Look at him. I think I've seen enough. Your Grace, it, it is a tradition for the Queen to stay until the victor has emerged. Yeah, he want to see her before she leaves. Mm -hmm. No, <laughs> yeah. With your turn, you piece of fucking. <laughs> oh my god. Look at this. Look. He can't see. I can't see. He said, I can't see. Really? Yeah. You better not cut it. What they gonna do? Look at her. Look at her. <laughs> well, thank you. Hmm. No, I'm just trying to get out of there. Watch this. Get him out of my sight. I brought you a gift. It's true. He has. Who are you? I am the gift. It's a pleasure to meet you, Your Grace. My name is Tyrion Lannister. <sighs> this half looks for real. This is horrible. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. I brought you this. Venison. I had it oh, myself you? for supper only last night. I don't eat nothing oh, she brought. Yeah, I don't eat nothing she brought. What? Tommen even went to the set himself to confront the High Sparrow. I know you did this. No, that's right. And what if she pregnant with Thomas Shire? I swear to you by all the seven gods. Lies come easily to you. But innocence, decency, concern. You're not very good at those, I'm afraid. Perhaps that's why your son was so eager to cast you aside for me. Mm. I'll visit again when you've had a chance to calm down. I don't want to see you again. Get out, you hateful bitch! <laughs> God. Punch on our face. Thank you, Buck. Well, apparently he... His little philosophy analogy. What happens to her now? Uh, you, she the few, you the many, but you fear her and doing her bidding. Yeah. Who will stand judge? Seven septons. Will you be one of them? I will. <laughs> if one or both of them were to confess before the trial. Then they will be shown the mother's mercy. What about you? Sleeping with your brother. Killing your husband? The Tyrell's finery will be stripped away. Their lies knocked down. Their true hearts laid bare for all to see, and so it will be for all of us. What will we find when we strip away your finery? Mm. Yeah, helper. A man came to us not long ago, broken in body and spirit. Mm. So much weighing him down. Now his soul is so light, he will float through the seven heavens like a bird. Mm. And he has much to say about you. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, helper, don't work out for you good. Come on. Get her too. Get her too. Hey. Come on. Let me go. You would order her to let me go. I am the queen. What? What? Your mind. You ain't the queen. Well, he's in the dungeon. What? Yeah. Look at my face. 
It's the last thing you'll see before you die. Your son ain't gonna do nothing, remember? <laughs> That's good. That's good. That's good. I'm so I think happy. He's gonna come back to something. So, gonna come back to her. I'm glad he's so, because he's so high and mighty, you know. And like the uh, uh, what's her name? The older lady, Olena. Yeah, she like yeah, like you live amongst you. These are thieves, you know, thieves, murderers, rapists. Yeah. Who are y'all? Y'all just mad because the other people still doing and they higher up than y'all. Yeah. That's what it is. The reality of it is. I'm going to burn this in there. I bet y'all still raping and doing all the other crap. Probably. Stealing. How you get your food? I don't know. Stealing. But, yeah. But Cersei was stupid thinking that she can do all this and give them all that power and they wouldn't find out about her. You yeah, forgot about yeah, yeah. you forgot about Lancel then, huh? Mm. <laughs> he knows all her secrets. That the king ain't the king. Well, that he or she, the king ain't the king. Yeah. Well, she was sleeping on with him while the king was alive, and he killed the he king. He killed the king. Basically, yeah. got him drunk and probably knows about her brother. <laughs> Boom, boom, boom. What? Okay. Well, that was a good episode. I love seeing Cersei thrown in the dungeon and her own little cell while she went she to go She was so proud her. of herself after going to talk to Marjorie. Yeah. Smiling and everything was just walking like, I'm better than you. <laughs> and she got thrown in there herself. I wish she could have got thrown and right there in the same cell with a margin. Oh, yeah. I would have been that would have been that. great if they would have did that. But thank you guys for joining us on this journey. If this is your first time, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And as always, a thumbs up and your comments. Until next time, bye bye. I want to see another one then. <laughs>